We're live. Welcome to tonight's Bringing Up Bates live chat. We the have the second new show of the season. That's right, season eight B. It's all going down tonight, and I hope that's not the way the golf game goes. But you're going to see that there's a lot of action. We're in Nashville, which is awesome. So we're going to be well. We're not actually in. In the episode. Right now, but right now we're in the living room. First off, we got Isaiah in here. Hey, we got Nathan. We got Nathan Ma. And, and Lawson just came back from the Bahamas. Lawson got back a few days before mm -hmm. Nathan. Nathan just literally walked in our front door. So. He flew in. And then we got Bradley. So, hey, Bradley. Hey. Are you going to answer any questions? Tonight. Oh, that's right. Mom, pull up. Oh, yeah. Whitney, you got some those? questions? Okay. Um, Y'all send in that. your questions. I'm going to be finding the questions. While mom tells you a little bit of the okay. three major components of tonight's episode. So, I'll tell you a little bit about tonight's episode. Tell them what's happening, Nate. Um, I got tonight's episode it. has a couple of special turn things. turn the volume down. Some of them are, for one, Dude, Carlin awesome. is going to try on her wedding dress. It's a big deal for girls. Huge deal. For us, not so quite a big deal. But there is something that will interest you. One of the greatest competitions in Bates history. And it's a top golf tournament between Aaron and Lawson. <laughs> it's really not that big of a deal. Prepare, prepare to see an amazing event. Happen. It was one of those things where, you know, there was. I'm rarely surprised by cheating involved you know, and athletic stuff like that. events, but this one amazed me. Where the truth and always prevails. I'm not amazed at all. I mean, okay, it was, it was I have amazing. to say, mm -hmm. I do have to say, Lawson has had the most experience. He has actually played top golf before. He has gone golfing a lot. Numerous line. times. Aaron Numerous definitely times. Guys. was on the underside of this deal because she. I don't it's think like a David and Goliath story. Don't, no, I don't it will know. just like boost okay, your let's confidence. Take a pause, let's take a little pause and breathe a little bit for a second. I don't know how they're going to portray this in this video. Actually, I do. The it's truth. The, 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 the truth. Way. It's not the truth. Okay, here's what the deal is it's very simple. You go to top, top Golf and they have a basic set of rules. You hit it in those far holes way out there, yonder over the hill, you get a lot of points. You hit it in those holes real close to you, you get a little points. But we go out there and the presenter of the game says, do you want to change the rules and make it where all holes are the same amount? What a terrible idea because that hurts the people that can hit it far. And that's what happens. Okay, so. some family of 11 from Wisconsin just drove past Rocky Top, our town, hey, and honked for us. We wish safe. we could have met you. Well, Sorry. You. So we're kind of cooped up here in the house because can you turn the camera around and show them daddy? Here is injured Gil. Gil just had surgery today. So you will see it on a later episode. Yeah. <laughs> So, Happy 17th birthday to Haley Marie. He's actually feeling good right now because he's still um, not feeling pain yet. It's the doctor said the pain's supposed to hit him sometime in the middle of the night. Bradley, I'm leaving a Bradley, okay. Bradley, do you think you would be good at golf? Yeah, pretty good. You could he really can hit a golf ball office. really far. Do you have a golf uh, club? At okay. Home? Somebody asked how Whitney's pregnancy is going. She's actually here in the room, but she's not ready to film. She said, she's not no she's more. Not she ready to film, but, um, but she's did. here with us. Tell them, how's your mommy doing with a new to baby? Are you ready to meet the new baby? Is she good? Okay. <laughs> what, tell us the baby's new name. What's the new baby's name going to be? Chloe. Chloe, that's right. Because that it's going to be a little girl. Mm -hmm. And we're excited about that. Okay. What happened to Dad? Dad was okay, doing a push-up competition. I gotta tell this story. But yeah, Mom, okay. tell the story. Every time Gil preaches to you to kind of get their attention and respect, he does this push-up challenge. He tells them that for every one push-up that they can do, he'll do two. One-handed push-ups. Two one-handed one push one -handed push push-ups. He gets whoever can do the most push-ups. So this um, teenager did 76 push-ups. And Gil was doing his one-handed push-up. He was push on his way to... When he got to number 84, something popped. You can't be doing that many one-handed push-ups as old as he is. So the doctor told him if you ever want to do... I can't be doing that at any age. At any age, yeah. The doctor said if you want to do tree work again and hold a chainsaw, if you want to beat your boys oh, in basketball it. again, you need to have this <laughs> shoulder... <laughs> what is it called? Rotator, rotator cuff, cuff surgery. surgery. Torn so rotator cuff. He basically cuff. tore everything in there, but... Who's next to get married? Ooh, that's a good question. It looks like... I would like, say Trace. Yeah, Trace is the only relationship that's Look, announced. It's like I, this. Hey, guys. Advertisement here. Two available single guys. This 
she's just joking. We're really not available. No, they are available. Just um, so Trace, I think it's going to be the next. Happy twenty second birthday. Like, Somebody's wondering where I shop. Okay, so Hayden. most of my shopping now Everywhere that my goes. girls have a boutique, Bait Sisters Boutique. It's where I get a lot of my stuff. I also get a lot from a place called Christopher and Banks. But definitely I'm putting a plug in for my girls. So, Okay, who has the biggest feet in the family? That's a very out of the question. Ones that, uh, you picked to answer that. Out of the ones that are the Bates kids, I believe Trace has the largest foot size. But we'll also um, puts his foot in his mouth the most. Oh, <laughs> Zach's, Zach's, Zach's back there. Back. Some girl named Melissa says she so, loves Lawson. But out of the married ones that are married into the family, I believe John would win with a size 13. That's right. Okay. So, yeah. That's yeah I think the man has got a big to be like power to hold up the yeah, think, foundation. Yeah. Uh, okay, somebody listened to one of your sermons today, Gil. Okay, I'm a little bit partial, recovery but I for love, dad. love my honey's People are wishing you a speedy recovery. Thank y'all for praying. More about the episode tonight. We always say this every week, but it's true. You can tweet along during the episode on Twitter with the hashtag bringing up Bates, and the official account will maybe answer your questions right there, too. So during the show, you see something funny. 22nd birthday You see something show. you want to talk Somebody. about. Okay, tweet I'll give hashtag. you a behind-the-scenes yeah. thing about the show that you won't necessarily get in the show, but... Carlin's dress, she had described this dress. She wanted to, like, pick up a dress, run in the field. It'd be just really poofy Cinderella. And I saw this girl on Instagram running through a field with her wedding dress, but I could only see the back. And I said, Carlin, this is the dress you described. We searched for hours to find the front of the dress, and we finally found it. But the problem was it was made in Italy. We called, I don't know how many dress shops to see if they carried this brand of dress. We finally found a few that carried it, but not this particular model because it was a 2018 model. So our problem was she fell in love with the dress. She couldn't see it, but um, somebody that actually works with the Up TV network speaks Italian and called to find out where we could find this dress could we even afford it and where was it at so we're going to see the dress for the first time in this show things are not always on the internet like they are in person so it is a surprise to all of us but even the things you read you have to watch to find out (laughs) you'll be surprised abby says she's using i will always one of my songs in her wedding in december congratulations on your wedding i hope it goes somebody said i was going to take your sticker off your hat we don't take the sticker off. That makes it cool. Uh, no, <laughs> the sticker. Yeah, it can be old as ever. You the keep sticker the sticker is off. there so I can identify it. Especially since it's faded. Uh, then it would leave a black spark. A lot of people are hat. wishing Dad well. Thank you very Hey much. from Kentucky. Thank all of you. Hi to someone's daughter, Heather, that watches the show. Thank y'all. y'all. Y'all really don't know. When we run into people or we get emails from people that say they watch the show, that is such a huge encouragement. It's hard for us to watch it because it's like listening to yourself on the tape recorder. And Somebody says you're getting so big, Bradley. Hey, how about that, Bradley? Wait, He's getting it. big, man. How old are you now? What have you been five? doing I thought today? he was five. He oh. said four. <laughs> he Show acts like muscle. He, he acts like Show he's nine. The muscle. Show him the muscle. The guy's got oh, some muscle. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What a guy. He got it from his daddy. Okay, so wow. I've got to answer one question. It's not on here, but people have been asking... What happened to the new intro that we've been talking about? We talked about them filming a new intro. We have intro. filmed it. And it is there. That is coming on season nine. The new season that you're seeing right now is season actually... Season 8B. 8B. So they've kind of divided the seasons up into 8A, 8B. This is season 8B. 2020. New so have no fear. Coming. New intro. Get rid of those dirty socks in the first intro. It's going to be great. We're super excited about the new intro. Okay, while while the guys are here, Nathan, you just got in town. Nathan is not with us a whole lot. Just give us a brief update on what you've been doing lately. We got five big old minutes to yeah. tell. So, um, I do. I work with an organization called Medic Corps, and we do a lot of rescue stuff overseas. So, um, my last two places I've been the most are the Bahamas and the Philippines. So every 45 days, um, I go in with a team of doctors or pilots or specialists, and pretty much.
much for working in the Philippines to try to improve one of their regional hospitals to a level one trauma center and trying to put in a life flight system with helicopters. And then over the last couple of weeks, I've been down in the Bahamas uh, flying as a rescue pilot, um, flying helicopters and um, doing a lot of rescue stuff after the storm. So when the storm first hit in the Bahamas, um, while it was still on top of Freeport, we flew in um, from Miami around behind the storm, landed in Marsh Harbor, and we've spent three weeks almost there. Um, That's why Marsh got this sun here. So <laughs> we got a sun lot burn. of tan. We, we both and, got a little bit um, of sunburn. We spent a lot of time down there. We got to work with a lot of amazing groups and people, and there was, it was absolute devastation. Like, it was, it was hundreds of people that lost right their lives, the and, you know, so many people lost their homes. But seeing the rescue efforts and relief efforts, everybody coming together, it was an amazing experience. So um, I flew the helicopter back home, and then I just came home for the weekend. We're back on the We came home because I do not do well with taking care of the medical problems and pain, oh, and so I know that the, old dad. the pain is going to be hitting old. Gil. You can flip the camera around to him. He's not in pain yet. Sure dad. The pain is going to be hitting him easy now. Kind of tonight, so I called Nathan, and I'm like, Nathan, help, help. Please come home and help me. Michael also would normally help, but she is studying her little self to death. She's in nursing school right now, tests every day, just intense studying. So Nathan came to the rescue. He's going to help me on the all-night medicine oh, shift. People say, <laughs> people say mom should have a cookbook. Oh, my. Idea. That's only because they haven't tasted my cooking. Mm. Compared to my kids, they way outcook me. Even Zach. Zach's over here in the corner. Anyways, guys. Zach's like the pro-seasoned man. He's... There's the, Zach, Zach is one of the great cooks. He's Aaron is one of the great Aaron, cooks. Zach, Alyssa, Zach, Michael, Alyssa, all of they're the all kids getting super talented. Me. They get I so much experience. Me. We are getting close to the show. We hope you already have your TV tuned up TV and you're ready for all the excitement, drama, competition, energy, whatever happens tonight in tonight's new episode. So be ready. We hope you enjoy it. You can always sweet along during the show with the hashtag Bring it up, Bates. Say one more thing. A lot of people. One more thing. A lot of people are saying they're so sorry about Lawson's friend, Little Landon. Oh. That if you read his Instagram, he passed away recently, and we appreciate all of your prayers for the family. As we know that you know they're going to be dealing with this grief for many, many, many weeks, months, years to come. So thank y'all for praying for his. But family. Little Landon said he gave his life to Jesus Christ. When he was five, he wasn't afraid. He knew he was going to heaven to be with Jesus, and he was all ready to so, meet the Lord. So, so his family, don't fear for Brandon. It's for the rest of the people okay. here yeah. that need it's, to trust Christ with their life. Little Landon, hey, he's like a blessing to all of us. He, he uh, already beat us there. His family does appreciate all the encouraging words, and we are now That's ready for the new episode. The alarm just went off. So enjoy tonight's episode. We'll see you back right here next week, 845 Eastern, to talk about the next new episode. Tell them bye, Bradley. Bye. Good job, Bradley. For full episodes, scenes, and exclusive videos of Bringing Up Bates, go to uptv.com slash Bates.